Let's measure the power dissipated by the diode. Power is the product of voltage and current. I have the voltage and current defined here. Also note that I'm using passive sign convention. The arrow enters the positively labeled terminal for voltage. I'll pull out the watt meter. We have connections for both voltage and current. I'll connect the watt meter to match the voltage V and take care to match the polarity with your defined voltage V. All right, we need to then establish a path for current through the watt meter itself. I'll break this connection. I need to force this current then through the watt meter entering the positively labeled terminal comes out the watt meter and continues on its way. Let's trace this path. It enters the diode, enters the positively labeled terminal of the watt meter and continues on its way. Double click to pull up the numerical panel. And for this circuit we have just over 8 milliwatts.